An Ohio mother is charged with murder after police say she left her 16-month-old daughter home alone for more than a week while she went on a vacation, resulting in the toddler's death. Ms. Candelarian's 16-month-old daughter Jalen was found unconscious at her home on 16 June, according to a statement by the Cuyahoga County Sheriff's Office. While the Cuyahoga County Medical Examiner's Office is conducting a full autopsy to determine the toddler's cause of death, investigators concluded that she died during the 10 days she was left unattended at the house. The Statement from the Cleveland Police Candelario confessed to leaving her toddler alone while she went on vacation for 10 days, authorities said. The incident report states that by Candelario's very own admission, she revealed that she left Jalen at home, all alone and unattended from June 8 until June 16 while she was vacationing in Puerto Rico and Detroit, Michigan. Candelario's neighbors reportedly told Cleveland NBC affiliate Keek that Candelario was known as an absentee mother. Neighbors said that in August, 2022, Candelario dropped Jalen off at their apartment, and asked if they could watch the child for a weekend. However, they said that Candelario then disappeared for several weeks, either refusing to answer her phone or offering excuses about why she was unable to get her baby. I was the one calling her saying, look I need milk. I need money. I don't have money to buy milk for your baby. What am I supposed to do? One of the women said, recounting conversations and messages left for Candelario. They claimed Candelario eventually picked up Jalen after about six weeks. The women reportedly told the station they wished Candelario would have left the baby with them instead of just abandoning her all alone. Jalen really didn't deserve what happened to her. She was amazing and really adorable and I miss her a lot, she said. Neighbor Sulein Gonzalez told Wuyo that the baby was typically cared for by her grandmother. Ms. Candelario is currently being held on a $1 million bond. She is expected to appear in court again on the 28th of June.